Man, I gotta tell you guys, this just freaking sucks, man. I've been able to lock in on every single shooting change except this freaking last one. It's really upsetting, and I know the struggles that y'all go through. I'm a player just like y'all, and I can't help but feel like it's a user error, like it's my fault because I'm watching folks greening out there. How many of you guys are going through the same thing? You see your homies greening, but you're struggling to shoot. If you guys have found a way, I need y'all to sound off in the comment section. Show me the way. We we finna get into the most up-to-date shooting changes on 2k24 y'all be sure to drop a like and drop a sub if you can as you guys know i don't like to waste your time so we finna just jump right into this i want to reference this first tweet from badge plug he says limitless range was changed again recently and he has proof in his video so y'all be sure to check out badge plug on his channel he dropped the video on the changes for limitless range and he says and not a single person from 2k said anything and y'all already know this is what i be preaching like we need transparency Badge Plug goes on to say, I think it was a good change, but I just want transparency. Why are we getting on the game and Easter egg hunting for shooting changes? And I can't front you that's the trouble that I have as well. Any change should be announced. The consumer base, the players, we should immediately know what's going on. And I had a feeling this was gonna happen. You see, I wanted transparency to the point at which when the game is stable, then the dev team could dip off and do what they gotta do. I was hoping that the community and the dev team could take this journey together on finding just the right balance to make the game playable for all players. I can't help but feel like we've just been abandoned by the dev team. And I'm not trying to be too harsh on the dev team because i understand they got work to do i understand they're still working on creating a balance in 2k24 but to me as a player that all goes out the window when we lose contact with them and then there's still changes being made on 24 i don't know what y'all feel about that but y'all sound off in the comment section it just seems like they're here to sell the game for the first month or so and after that everything is crickets and we gotta fend for ourselves also if you guys notice a change with limitless range sound off share your thoughts i want to reference this next tweet from Dynasty. That's right, Dynasty, the man that was accused heavily of having a zen because he was killing folks in pro-am gameplay. Dynasty says, I've played every 2K since 2K14. This game is dead, the worst installment of this franchise ever released. Give me demigods on 15 and the high rollers over this ish. Give me five out all dunks of 2K18. No one who plays this ish competitively has fun playing the game. It's genuinely awful. And this is from the man that was shooting well against highly competitive players when nobody else was able to even hit open shots. I don't know what else to say, yeah? It's such a mixed bag of feedback from players on 2K. Some folks struggling tremendously while others are just lights out. It's so weird. The good homie Dimework is struggling too. Dimework says, I literally went from shooting almost 80% from three over 20 games to not being able to hit a shot for the effing life of me. I just don't get this ish. And over the last couple days, I've been feeling very similar to dime work. The joint is a struggle, man. Just when I thought I had shooting locked in and I was going to have an amazing year, I thought season two, I was going to be shooting upwards of 50, 60%. And now I feel like I'm shooting like I got a 60 overall out there. Like I said in the beginning, I feel like this partly due to user error. It's pretty much my fault. I need to hit the lab, get some practice in and relearn my jump shot. It ain't like I don't see the homies greening their shots out there. And this next tweet from Hank the Tank, he just goes in for the sake of my mental health i will never wager on nba 2k24 and i can't front with all these changes i don't know how folks out there even thinking of wagering it's just crazy to me the amount of times mike wayne has changed shooting is absolutely insane one day i shoot perfect the next day i'm missing everything wide open and i'm releasing my jump shot at the exact same time he is literally tired of people shooting good and chooses to make them shoot bad because they're too good at the game i just just don't get it bro that's only gonna make the game harder for casuals as well lmfao it's a lose lose for everyone it's just a humongous headache for everyone and i gotta say that's facts man it is a headache to constantly have to be learning these different changes to shooting but i could also understand why mike wang was just confucius out there because when i thought shooting was good a good portion of the 2k community was complaining about shooting i feel like they just should have left the game alone for those that follow me you know i've been saying this leave the joint alone stop with the changes as you guys saw in that last message from hank the tank he referenced casuals out there and how making shooting 
shooting changes like this, if comp players are struggling to shoot, then imagine what it's like for casuals. Or at least that's what Hank the Tank was saying. And here goes a message from Bobby Brownie, who represents casuals. He says, why y'all always using casuals as your gaslight machine? Comp players are complaining more than casuals. He says, I'm a casual and I'm just fine with shooting, being more difficult than in previous 2Ks. The game needed some balance. Just stop crying out there. How many of you guys are tired of hearing folks complaining about the game? And I just want to add a little cherry on the Sunday. I've seen a lot of casuals shooting really well out there, and I honestly don't hear as much negative feedback from the casual player base. If you're a casual playing 2K right now, share your feedback in the comments section. I want to know if you're struggling. How did you guys meet the learning curve to shoot well if you are shooting well? Or if you're having trouble out there shooting, what do you guys feel needs to be adjusted to make it easier to enhance your casual experience? Definitely curious to hear your feedback. We will be going live a little later on today. I want to remind you that Lunatics tryout, tryouts for the Lunatics, the All City Lunatics will be taking place this weekend at 3 p.m. Think we're going to do it on Saturday. If you guys are tired of running with randoms and you want to run with folks that have a higher aptitude for 2K, higher IQ, definitely try out for the All City Lunatics, an exclusive group of over 100 players who run daily, completely eliminating the need to run with casual. All you guys got to do is join the Discord and the link for Discord will be in the description below. If you guys are tired of running with randoms and you're looking for players to run with on NBA 2K, come on out and join our Discord. We'd love to have you. The link for Discord will be in the description below. I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in and y'all be sure to keep it locked right here at All City Live TV because we got a bunch more NBA 2K24 news, information, and updates coming your way. Drop a like and drop a sub on your way out. I'll catch you guys on the next video or live stream. Easy, y'all.